Not sure what I'm going to do with this. This is Priscilla Batzell in Spring Hill, Florida, Expressionist Art Studio Gallery. With some paint left at the end of the day, and I'm supposed to be going in <laughs> and putting away my paints. But what I'm going to do instead is whatever comes to mind. I'm going to use my OXO omelette turning spatula available on my Amazon link underneath the video along with the new book because I can. I'm going to worry about my edges later. I'm probably going to scrape out whatever is in my... You know what? I'm not. I'm just going to take it and use it as a landscape tool. And hope it works. Because I always wanted to do this. Just, just exactly this. Just make stripes across with paint. And I have paint left. I can put some stars in those skies. In the sky? Really? Okay. <laughs> My articulate nature is becoming lackadaisical to say the least. My tongue is twisted, in other words. So I'm going to throw a little bit of white pearl in there. And some of my purple. And some of my red-orange. And some of my black. And just ribbon pour it back and forth. Scrape out whatever's left. And that's going in the bucket. Oh, come on. Just one last little scoopful and I had to have it, didn't I? I'm going to wipe that right over the, on the end. And this. I've got that same bronzy color. I didn't use any bronze, but I used quite a bit of gold and orange and red. So those were all my leftover colors. I'm just going to wipe my finger right down the edge. And then I'm going to use my spatula with the paint that's on it. I'm not trying for spectacular, I'm just using up paint and having a good time. I haven't decided what I'm going to do yet with what I've got, but I did it, so <laughs> it is what it is. I've got a little more, ah, uh, i got a little more paint on my fingers is what I've got. I'm going to let that, oh, yep. I think putting my glasses on again would probably be an excellent solution to not seeing things clearly, don't you think? And if I hadn't put them there, if I hadn't put them down somewhere I couldn't find them, I would have known where they were. So I'm still going to do what I was just doing, which is to add a little line of black along the edge and use my finger and cover that edge so I don't have to think about it again later and the paint will dry at the same rate, which I like a lot. And I may, I may just add some stars to that sky. I've got my little stripes. I don't know what they signify. Probably water to degree. To I'll just let that go right over there. I like the little purple. I don't want to destroy my stripes completely. That looks a little bit odd up there. Oh, goody, I've stuck the handle of my spatula into the shovel reservoir. <laughs> I'm not nervous, no. So what do I want to do? Anything? I don't see anything I really want to do. It's just a simple little piece and um, with stars it'll be an interesting little piece. I could put a moon in there, but I'm going to rinse that shovel off and that spatula has got to go and just keep. The temptation is to, the temptation to do, is to do all kinds of stuff. Um, do I really want to? That's the question. Maybe I should just allow myself the pleasure of having some fun for a minute, doing something I never do. Yeah, no, that's a lie. I'm always having fun. 
There are far worse things in this world than being addicted to paint pouring. The chain had occurred to me. I kind of just, this is one of those moments where I'm going to claim the love of simple things. And I have to decide how simple I want to leave it. And you know, that's probably not happening with me. And I like that white right there. And the black is fresh, so I'm not going to worry about that blending. I'm looking at that orange down there and liking the way it looks. I'm thinking to myself, what's better than a little? <laughs> a little more. And that's pretty cool. So. I guess all bets are off, especially since that just splooged right there. Bummer. That's not what I had in mind at all. Let's see what happens. Maybe I can camouflage it. Maybe I can't. But chances are good I can. Or not. <laughs> Maybe just throw a little more of the blue on top of the area. No biggie. All right, so more blue? No? Yes? Maybe? No idea. No. Well, that was easy. More purple. Always room for more purple. So this is a really different little piece, and I think I'm just going to go for it. and add a yellow stripe, because I can. And then I'm going to torch, because I can. I'm just not sure I'm done yet, but it's pretty cool. I like it. Maybe just a little bit of this magenta red. some purple. Makes me want to put a, a white white pearl in here. Okay, so that's cool. That's just basic entertainment. I didn't really expect we would get a lot of cells. I wasn't looking for that. I was just kind of using up some paint and making stripes. And I like what I've got. Just getting rid of the bubbles in the paint, if there are any. We're making some little cells, trying not to catch the painting on fire as it smokes. And it is smoking. All right, so we've got tons of time, but my paint is used up. So we're going to call that a pouring quickie. And uh, I like the colors. It's just nice. It's a nice little piece. So this is Priscilla Batsell in Spring Hill, Florida at Expression Start Studio Gallery saying check under the video under Show More for my Teespring clothing and the paint pouring recipe and volumes one, two, three of the Facebook albums that contain the wet and dry artworks from YouTube, the Pinterest link, the Instagram link. I do sell my artwork. <laughs> I'm getting a little better at this for a minute at least. I do sell my artwork and uh, there are over 380, probably 390 videos going on 400 by now. So watch some more. And please, 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 if you wouldn't mind very much, giving me a thumbs up. I want this other color in here. Oh well. Yep, that's just what I wanted right there. The finishing touch. Do I need any more of that? It's so hard to stop. <laughs> hmm. Can't leave me alone with paint. <laughs> I think that's that's better. Break it up a little bit. All right, so we're good to go. I told you almost everything. I did beg for a thumbs up. Please, please, please. Um, I love you guys. Thank you all for the contributions, and I hope to see you in the next video. Keep making comments. I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Let's make sure all of that's there.
Let's turn it the way I'm appreciating. Hey, it kind of looks okay both ways. Let's zoom in on that. It's no big deal. It's a little abstract expressionist stripe with some accidental paint mixed, paint mixed in. And um, this is me saying, Happy New Year! Bye for now. Priscilla out.